humans. Are human beings yours to buy and sell? Are they? Can you answer that question? Yeah, I see the smirks from over there, the vile twisting of facial expressions. It offends you, doesn't it, to be faced with what you're standing for, I bet. But you know what? I don't care. I don't care how you feel about whether or not human beings should be bought or sold. I care about whether or not that's moral or immoral. I care about whether or not that's right or wrong. And if I were the last human being on earth to say it's wrong, I would stand with pride against everyone. But what makes me proud is the fact that I'm not standing alone. I might be in the minority in this chamber, but I'm on the right side of history. I'm in the majority of folks outside these walls who believe that we should not buy and sell human life. This is really simple. Right now, in a few minutes, in a few moments, that board is going to light up. And the green dots next to the names for history, for perpetuity, until the end of time are going to be recorded as those who thought it was okay to buy and sell people in 2024. Not in 1964, not in 1932, not in 1864, but today, the people who are for the buying and selling of people are going to have green dots next to their names up there in a few minutes. Yeah, I love the laughs, the smiles, the casual disregard for the importance of what it is you're about to do. History is going to record it, and you're going to answer for it in eternity. The clerk will take the roll on the bill. There being 68 ayes and 61 nays, the bill is passed and its title agreed to.